anybody, any of you, anybody, can go up to any homeowner that has any loan, any mortgage, from any lender at any house at any time, and you can make them a deal. And the deal any of you can make with any homeowner that has any loan, any mortgage, from any lender at any house at any time is this. Here's the deal. I will make the payment on your mortgage for you going forward. Or I will find somebody to make the payment on your mortgage for you going forward. What's the catch? The catch is you have to transfer the deed, which is ownership of the property to me. It's called buying a property subject to the existing mortgage. You do this with any homeowner, with any loan, from any lender, in any house at any time. And the only person on the planet that has to agree to this transaction is the person whose name is on the deed, not the bank. So there's so many strategies that I have learned throughout the whole process yep. that there's so many ways to make money. And so my thing was I started with those cash offer wholesales and then I started figuring out how can I do something creative, right? And you know, eventually that led into subject two, which, so I've done over 10 deals. One of them was a fix and flip, the other 10 were wholesales. Nine out of 10 of those wholesales were subject two deals. Right. I've only done one cash offer. Like I mentioned, like that first deal was a cash offer deal. And then I started negotiating off of those cash offer deals moving forward. And I was like, wow, this is tough. There's just, it's hard to make a good deal off of just straight cash. So then I started looking at sub two. Um, and that's something where it really opened the door. Have creatively. you done equity partner yet? Uh, so we're looking at some now. Okay. I, I'm kind of like on the fence with it. I like the idea and I especially like it if we can get into it where we don't have to put any acquisition down. So if we can get into it where they transfer the deed, we share ownership of the property and then we go in, we fix up the property. There's and many then, ways that you can work with that. I've done a lot of uh, equity firing, so I know it works yeah. and I love it. Yeah, and the numbers make sense. You know, I haven't yeah. done one yet, but I'm, I'm definitely interested. And then you're going to see the money really coming in. Yeah, because that at that point you're you can get in without putting any money in. But even the deal. if you put the money in, some money because sometimes you have to pay for them to move out. Mm -hmm. You don't want to ever do it on equity fund then staying on the property. I think the most important thing with that is making sure that the seller like you're there for them and you're making sure that it's the most easiest process possible for them. Come meet us and uh, click on the link in the comments below.